What's going on? Back plugged in again. What's your boy the profit, eh? Yo. So today we back plugged in again for another Bleach Brave Souls video. And yeah, your boy just had a cold and like I was just feeling all type of crazy. I still might sound a bit congested, but I thank you guys for being here. So today it will definitely help me out a lot if you guys can go ahead and support me on Twitch. Twitch.tv slash d 24 is up top and it's down in the description below. So we do have some news that uh, we have not covered just yet. So a couple things that we want to talk about. The main thing, the thing that the title is going to be speaking about is I really hope that this banner right here is the future, I would say, for Bleach Brave Souls. And that's this Brave Fest banner. Now, if we go ahead and look at the draw rates of the banner, you can see something very special that I believe has only happened one time. Um, in this particular banner, the rates are kind of wonky. It's a 5% banner, but it's 4.3% on the 5-star character and 0.7% towards the featured character. So it's 5% in total, but the, there's one featured character and you have these other 8 5-stars that aren't featured, but they're in the filler pool i guess you would say right so not going to get into all the steps right here but this pretty much is how the banner is set up it's that art book ichigo is going to be guaranteed after 20 steps okay and so this is a 100 percent chance guarantee to get art book ichigo now let's see looking at the rates it looks kind of weird so we'll just go ahead and look at the main information from the banner um because looking at the rates page can be kind of weird sometimes and if you don't know what you're looking at it can be a little bit intimidating so i want to show you guys the easiest viewing format for everything so it's going to take a look at the brave at fest step 20 featured character Okay, one five-star summon guaranteed a certain step. Step 20 guarantees a featured character exclamation mark. You feel me? So they're like, yo, this, this, this shit is fire. A Brave Fest summon that guarantees the featured character step 20 is here. This time, the character that you're guaranteed to receive is the Ichigo art book version. See, detail, see below for details, my bad. Um, yeah, so feature five-star character character guaranteed at step 20 so this banner has already been out for a little less than 24 hours now so with that being said taking a look at these actual fillers they're pretty damn good okay like oh man i'm i'm definitely not going 20 steps on the banner and i'm going to skip it because our book ichigo is a premium character and that kind of is what it is but these, this is a crazy damn good selection of premium characters. Now, when I said something about this being the future, what I meant is guaranteeing one character. The annoying thing is how the game is set up, how banners are in this game. It's impossible it's not necessarily impossible, but it's it's very difficult for them to implement a guaranteed, you know, featured character at step 20 or whatever, right? The reason is because we have at least two to three characters coming out for banner. Now, we do have, like, the arena banners. And I know we got, like, the Burn the Witch banner with Bruno. But that basically was a, like, Burn the Witch arena banner. But, obviously, that's not what it was called. But Bruno is a freaking arena character, basically. So, it kind of had the same format except with Burn the Witch characters instead of arena characters. Which are all premium. I digress, though. The, the reason is that there's a selection of characters and you know let's just say they say all right 20 steps we guarantee one of the two or one of the three then 
what they would have to do is on the solo banner guaranteed 20 steps of the banner to get the main character right and that would be the end all be all the solution to how we could get guaranteed character race in bleach brave souls it's like but how do we make that a thing man because k lab they always try stuff they always change things up you know, and then and then they also go back to formula that we that they know we don't like, like the and the twelve character. Mind you, I don't want to say people we don't like the step ups or the like the the poll selection banner, but for instance, anniversary they're generally like twelve characters and one or two new ones. So you know they always go to this one guaranteed step. And it's like, what are you, why, 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 why do you go back to a guaranteed step, like, on the best banner of the year? There's only one guaranteed step, and then every other multi after that, you're just floating in no man's land. So it's like, it's, it's really frustrating. I feel like this is the type of banner that they should do, even if they have to wait three to four months after a character is released. If they're a premium, of course, do this type type of banner. And I know this is called Brave Fest, but they're saying this like they're like this time the character that you're guaranteed to receive is Ichigo artwork version. And of course, which what's going to follow this, I'm telling you guys, is they're gonna do six anniversary Aizen in a similar type of banner. Because Arbic Ichigo is like the part one, and then Aizen is the part two. So be on the lookout for Anniversary Aizen, for 6th Anniversary Aizen to come out on a guaranteed banner where you'll be able to get him. Now, 20 steps on a standard banner. Let me just take a look to see uh, what the first step is. Okay, 150, 250. And then... Um, uh, okay, yeah, so, so that basically, that trend should continue. 5, 10, 15, 20. Okay, so... So there's only two actual discounting steps. That's kind of stinky. So so step six is 250. All right, so that just means it's gonna cost you just under 5,000 orbs to get um, to get to your 20 steps. Uh, if, if I recall, yeah, it's like, it's gonna be 1,100 orbs roughly to go from one to five. And so it's going to be about 45 or 4,600 orbs, depending on how stuff lands for this particular banner. So 4,500 orbs, dude, that's a lot of orbs. That's a lot of orbs. And even for a game like this, where they provide about, you know, anywhere between 1,500 to 2,000 orbs a month, that's basically saying don't summon on anything for two months to be able to guarantee a character. And is that fair? Definitely. I mean, I would definitely say so. I, I wish that this would happen more often, but make sure you guys weigh in. Let me know how you feel about this particular banner. We did have a little bit of additional news. We got a new accessory coming out, but nothing at all to really write home about because it is a, um, it's a, a drain reduction item. Let me see new accessories coming out. And this came out um, a day or so ago. Um, Mitatarashi Dango reduces drain duration. So this won't be like, this won't dilute the pool for golden accessories or whatever. So that, you know, that, that's not a negative in that regard. But, um, what we're looking at here, just so you guys know, we're pretty much now going to be saving up our tickets until, uh, I guess seventh anniversary. And, uh, you know, we're working on a nice little stack here, 720 or 712 there, um, you know, under a thousand, but will of course be to a thousand by the time over a thousand, probably like 2,500. And so it's like, we're, we're saving pretty heavy. Like these four to five star tickets are actually pretty dang tough to come by. That's a lot of guild quests and stuff like that. But yeah, man, that's what we're working on. Um, we do have a little bit more information and I do have some more videos. I promise you guys, I'm going to get back plugged in with content. I have a lot more to come. 
And uh, yeah, man, I won't talk about it. I'll just get to it. Till next time, Private Nation. I love y'all. I'm out. Oh,